Hello, we're back for another video on the Ark, and after doing a top 20 PvE base locations on the Lost Island map, I decided I'm going to be doing every map installment on Ark, so we're going to start with the island map today, and let's get straight into it. Starting at number 20, we got 56.0 latitude, 78.1 longitude. That is our location on the map. We're on the edge of the swamp here. I've put a few structures down just so you can get an idea of what the area is like. It's quite flat on top up there. you got a water source right here. Quite close to the mountain opposite Carnival Island there. You've got easy access to all those rare resources. Green obelisk is right there. And if you head to the ocean, northeast direction from here, you'll find the Caverns of Lost Hope, which is one of the best caves in the game. So it's a very good location. There's lots of building opportunities in this area. Next base location is going to be at 15.9 latitude, 69.9 longitude. That is our location on the map, right near Kano Island here. So you've got easy access to those great creatures to tame. Of course, right next to the water as well. You can build a really good water pen to house your water creatures. Little pool here. Of course, over these trees is Hidden Lake where the beaver dams will spawn. And you're in between, basically, in the middle of three mountains here. So you've got easy access to all those rare resources. Next base location is at 88.9 latitude, 24.5 longitude. Here's our location on the map. Just go out from here. We're right at the edge of the ocean. This is Crags Island. You could definitely make a really cool base in here. The only downside is it's not really close to any metal spawns. The Redwoods Mountain here is probably the closest uh, metal spawn. But of course, you are right next to the Red Obelisk. You've got a water source right below you. Nice explore note there as well. And you can make a really cool water pen here also. It's just a really nice place to build. Next base location is going to be 86.6 latitude, 54.6 longitude. It's our location on the map, directly at the bottom of the map. This is Stonehenge. So there's plenty of building opportunities around here. It's not the best um, flat location. I think why it shines is because just of the location it's so picturesque should we say and of course you've got the big lake here cul-de-sac lake kind of thing where you could have a really big water base if we just go up from here but there is a mountain there that has a bit of metal on if you just go east from here this is a beaver dam spawn as you can see you can see the beavers here so it's very close, you've got some end post on your doorstep. Next base location is located at 44.2 latitude, 76.5 longitude. Here's our location on the map. Water is very close by. If we just turn around, you'll see my monstrosity of a build. This is just to showcase the area. I am no builder by any means, so that's pretty uh, ugly looking. But uh, you can see you can build all around here. It's a really nice location. You can build around these rocks, just like I've attempted to do. Right next to Green Obelisk. Once again, really close to Caverns of Lost Hope on the east of the map. And just surrounded by mountains again, you've got this mountain right next to you. Just across the way is Obsidian Mountain over there and the Redwoods over there. Next base location is going to be 45.2 latitude, 81.2 longitude. Here's our location on the map. There's this rock formation below us here. It's not the flattest area, but it's a really cool looking base location. You could definitely build something cool around here. But directly below this mountain here. Opposite Carnot Island. If you look directly east from this direction, you're really close to the Caverns of Lost Hope. And Green Obelisk is not too far away either. Next base location is located at 42.7 latitude, 66.0 longitude. Here's our location on the map. As you can see, I've put a few foundations down. It's quite flat for a small base location. If you just go up here, there's metal right on your doorstep on top of this cliff. Right outside, you have a nice stream for your water source. Also, there is a beaver dam spawn right here. So be careful not to block that, because that is nice to keep. And of course, you've got Obsidian Mountain right there to the northwest. The only downside is obviously there's no place to really build a water pen. Next base location we have is 70.1 latitude, 12.2 longitude and that is our location on the map. Once again another base that's near the Caverns of Lost Faith Cave just over there to the north. 
as you can see this one is a large flat spot it's a really good spot i really like this base location you're not too far away from the volcano from all your rare resources and obviously you've got this cold de of war where you can play around with a, a water base most likely or you can just build your water base on oceanside and of course you're right next to the red obelisk so you ain't got too far to go so you just want easy access to a boss fight next base location is going to be at 44.0 latitude 29.6 longitude Here's our location on the map, right at the base of the volcano, which makes this spot a great area to build because you can get all your metal and rare resources up there. Pretty close to Snow Mountain as well and Blue Obelisk, which is just there. If you turn around, Redwoods is right there and the Beaver Dams aren't too far away either. It's a really nice spot to build, it's quite a pretty location. Nice and flat on top of this waterfall and you can obviously extend over here. There's all these river bushes just here, and if you just use the Bronto a sec, these are the best bushes in the game to farm berries. We get a lot of berries. Next base location is going to be at 56.3 latitude, 18.2 longitude. Here's our location on the map. If we just zoom out from here, it's quite a nice flat spot. Really close to the volcano just here, as you can see, beaver dams are down there. Swamp Caves over there in the Redwoods and you got your water source right below, really nice location to build. And of course Caverns of Lost Faith is right down there towards the west. Next base location is at 28.0 latitude, 16.4 longitude. This is our location on the map. We're in the Iceberg area, as you can see there's oil everywhere. This is where we're building, we're in this uh, horseshoe kind of like canyon. It's a really good spot, I've built here before also. As you can see, it's quite flat in the middle, so if you build around the middle area, you could probably save some of these resources and they could keep spawning for you. There's oil, crystal and metal all around here. Nice cheeky exploring note there. Of course, you're right next to Blue Obelisk and all the metal and resources on that mountain. Access to all snow creatures and the ocean is right on your doorstep. So you've got silica pearls and oil right around here. You've got penguins on your doorstep also. Next base location is going to be located at 21.5 latitude, 69.3 longitude. Solid location on the map. This is the hidden lake. It's just a really pretty place to build. Nice few flat areas around the edge. Obviously you've got a water source in the middle. Beaver dams do spawn here, so it might be frowned upon building here on a PvE official map. Because you might block those, but uh, you are surrounded by three mountains. Once again, this is just a bit further inland than uh, one of the previous base locations on the list. So you've got access to all those rare resources and high tier creatures to tame. Next base location is going to be 17.5 latitude, 83.5 longitude. Here's our location on the map. We are at Kano Island. Of course you got access to water here you could build a really good water pen over there so the only thing you want to be wary about of building on here is blocking the spawns because obviously this is carnival island there are lots of carnivals that spawn here you want to keep the spawns what i've found is that if you build in the center here nothing really spawns in here or on the south side of the island creatures don't tend to really spawn on this side much obviously there's a few scorpions down there now but that's about it of course you got the mountain over there for all your rare resources, not too far of a trek. And you got the artifact of the Devara Cave on the north side of the island, just there. Next base location is going to be the iconic Herbivore Island, of course. It's a location on the map. We're obviously right in the ocean here. It's an isolated island. Coordinates are 82.9 latitude, 83.8 longitude. This is the iconic horseshoe where you can have a great water base. It's very flat in the middle. And if you somehow do not build on top, you've got a nice decent amount of metal nodes on top as well. Just surrounding it. As you can see, you have access to that on your doorstep. Of course, it's the only downside is living isolated. But nonetheless, this is one of the best locations on the map. Next base location is going to be at 46.1 latitude, 72.7 longitude. It's our location on the map. This is a great base location and this area is pretty much completely flat. Obviously it's not the 
widest area but you can make a, a long structure and of course you've got the big lake for your water source you could potentially breed ocean creatures in here with cryopods obviously because you can't get them out there is also metal nodes in the water if you're looking to farm those as you can see there's one there and there's a few more but of course you probably won't be too fussed about that when you are metal mountain right there close to green obelisk close to the redwoods and you've got obsidian mountain it's not too far away either next base location is going to be 41.7 latitude 15.7 longitude here's our location on the map although maybe not the prettiest location as it's right on the beach it is a really good spot to build if you can keep the wild spawns intact because if you just go directly north from here there's this corner here where all carnivores and really good herbivores will spawn and you even get the odd alpha predators spawn in here too and i've always referred to this corner beach as the beach party as there's always a party of creatures having a great time you just have to be wary about them running into your base that's the only downside but if you just look at the area obviously you can build a cool water pen around here you've got the volcano right there so that's pretty close and this snow mountain here also oil silica pearls and rare resources as silica pearls will spawn in these waters here you can see we can just pick one up like that they do spawn in this shallow water here so they're very easily accessible you got those right on your doorstep it's a really good base location i love this spot next base location is located at 30.9 latitude 33.0 longitude here's our location on the map but on the ice in the river here i like this because it's quite flat i think you can build a really cool base location in here i've never seen anyone build on here you're right outside the snow cave here as well so you got that right on your doorstep volcano is just here you've got easy access to all those rare resources same with the snow mine and blue obelisk right next to your base also so if you just go down here they're a bit hard to spot because it's very murky water but you will have silica pearls spawning in the bottom of the waters here as you can see so you can keep those spawning that's right on your doorstep also next base location is going to be located at 61.4 latitude 42.0 longitude here's our location on the map we're in the direct center of the redwoods basically this is a, a very flat location obviously you've got the option to build tree platforms and everything like that you're surrounded by three metal mountains here to the east in the redwoods that's uh, probably one of the best mountains to farm metal from anyway and to the west you have the swamp cave right on your doorstep also if you're looking to build up pretty quickly you could definitely do it here next base location is going to be 61.8 latitude 34.3 longitude it's our location on the map this is the redwoods lake you can build tree platforms around here it's very nice ground to build on some pretty nice flat areas you got the mountain directly east for all your metal and rare resources and also to the east you have the swamp cave which is round about there i think that's the entrance there and that is one of the best caves on the map for farming cement paste and probably leveling up very quickly but it's obviously a very difficult cave next base location is going to be at 58.3 latitude 23.3 longitude is our location on the map as you can see it's another really big flat spot right next to the redwoods right next to the volcano and just towards the northeast direction you have your beaver dam spawn location so therefore not too far to go for your water source that beaver dam just appeared out of nowhere that is going to be the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed it I hope it's helped you all i'll catch you on the next one where we will be doing the center top 20 pve base locations take care goodbye